okay, I got two more reharm ideas for improvising on all the things you are. I realize I'm beating a dead horse here now. This is about my sixth video on this subject, but real quickly, it won't take long. You know, one of the reharm rules I went over originally in my reharm video was that if you're doing a 2 5 1, you can change the 2 chord from a minor chord to a dominant chord, okay? And I'm going to change it to an altered dominant chord, put a sharp 9 into it. Now, uh, in the song All the Things You Are, it starts on F minor, goes to B flat minor, but I'm going to change that to B flat uh, seventh, okay? And look, uh, I could even consider the, the F minor a two chord. If, you, if all you mean by a two chord is it's a minor chord, I could change the first chord, F to F, uh, F minor, I'll change that to F dominant, and use like, um, you know, a sharp nine. So I could start off my improvisation, you know, pretty wild, you know. Uh, So there, I used F altered, uh, and then B flat altered, and then A altered, or, or e, e flat altered, to the A flat major. So I had three altered chords in a row. That's one idea. The second idea I come up with is, uh, and this I think is fairly original. I don't know, maybe some of you music theory uh, people, uh, ma music theory majors out there can shed some light on this. It's at the end of the A section after you've done the 2-5-1 in E, where it then changes to like that chord right there, okay, which is kind of like an E augmented, <laughs> okay, not, not an E altered really, it's more like a C altered. It's a six note scale, and it's based off the idea of the diminished scale. Um, you know, if you consider that you could, you're allowed to have a, a um, augmented interval in there, in your scale, like that, really just approaching each note of the chord with a half step. It works very nice at the end of that two, five, one. 